Braised bitter gourd with chicken is a classic home cooked dish hugely favored among the Chinese households in Malaysia. The bitter notes from the bitter gourd blend seamlessly with the tender chicken after absorbing the abundance of the bean sauce. You can make it at home easily with only a few simple steps. Let's dive in and take a look how to prepare the braised bitter gourd with chicken cooked with the bean paste. Step 1. Marinate the chicken. Cut the chicken into small pieces, bone in. The bone will release additional flavor while braising, which is the plus point of keeping the bone on. We use the reasonably standard marinade formula, nothing fancy. We have soy sauce, some ground white pepper, Shaoxing wine, and some corn flour and that's all you need marinate for at least half an hour should be sufficient for the small chicken chunks keep it in the refrigerator is preferred to keep it fresh step two cut and blanch the bitter guard remove both ends of the bitter guard Cut it crosswise into 4 to 5 cm sections. Cut it lengthwise into 2. Remove the seeds and the pith. I use a stainless steel spoon, which is very efficient. Cut the bitter gourd into julienne. Place it in a bowl and add a large teaspoon of salt. Combine well and let it sit for 10 minutes. Bring a pot of water to a boil. Place the bitter gourd in the water. and blanch for 2 minutes. After 2 minutes, drain. Step 3. Preparing the seasoning and the aromatics. Cut the ginger into thin slices and get a tablespoon of minced garlic. The seasoning consists of two main ingredients, the yellow bean paste and the black bean paste. This is yellow bean paste. And this is black bean paste. The preparation of the braising liquid is simple. Just add the oyster sauce, light soy sauce, ground white pepper, some cornstarch, and some water. Step 4. Braise the chicken and bitter gourd. Pan fry the chicken with some oil in a wok or saucepan until both sides turn slightly brown. So take the garlic and ginger until they turn aromatic.
Keep the heat low as the garlic can burn quickly. Add the yellow bean paste and the black bean paste. Saute until it turns aromatic. Add the bitter gourd. Stir fry until the bean paste coats the surface of the bitter gourd. Add the chicken. And the braising sauce. Braise over low heat for about 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, the bitter gourd should have turned soft. I suggest the minimum braising time should be 20 minutes so that that is sufficient time for the seasoning to absorb into the chicken. Add some hot water if the braise start to get dry. Do a taste test. Some gods are more bitter than the others. You can add some sugar at this point, or more bit paste if it is not savory enough. Reduce the liquid to a thick sauce. not watery. It will turn shiny and adhere to the chicken and the bitter gods. Now it is ready to serve best together with steamed rice. This is how I prepare the Chinese braised bitter gourd and chicken cooked with bean paste. You can download the recipe and read more details about it at tasteasianfood.com bitter gourd recipe. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button. You'll find there are many of the similar videos out there. Until then, I'll see you again in the next video. My name is KB Kwan. Bye for now.